The Minister of Agriculture and Rural Development, Dr. Mohamed Abubakar, says the livestock sector remains a major component of the agricultural economy and plays a significant role in the overall national economy as it accounts for about 2 to 5 percent of the national gross domestic product and 10 percent of the agricultural gross domestic products. But the challenges of growth in the livestock value chains are numerous, including low breed quality, poor animal husbandry practices, limited access to quality inputs and finance, weak animal health and extension services delivery, amongst others. This was identified at a just concluded two-day summit jointly organized by the Federal Ministry of Agriculture and Rural Development, FMAD, and the Agriculture Correspondent Association of Nigeria, Akan, in Abuja. The minister, while addressing stakeholders at the summit, employed them to take advantage of the potentials in the livestock sector as a major way of diversifying the economy from the oil sector. Recent estimates show that the livestock sector is endowed with abundant livestock resources with about 26.4 million cattle, 88.2 million goats, 50.3 million sheep, 8.9 million pigs, 465 million chickens and 1,234,288 uh, donkeys. This is from our 2021 uh, uh, information uh, database. The donkeys of which are being seriously uh, devastated now and we must make sure, please, that does not continue. This is I can say some kind of uh, conspiracy with people from within and without. And these donkeys provide a lot of mobility and all kinds of support for the rural people. Please and please, we should make sure we protect these animals. In spite of this potential, it is estimated that per capita consumption of animal source uh, food stand at 8 liters of milk, 9 kg of milk, and 3.5 kg or 55 eggs per year, which are very low consumption levels when compared with the global average of 44 liters of milk and 19 kg of meat, respectively. The president of Akan, John Oba, employs stakeholders not to treat the livestock sector with levity as it has a lot to offer, hence the team of the summit positioning the Nigerian livestock industry for the 21st century economy, a critical look at the National Livestock Transformation Plan, NLTP. Being that this summit will afford us, particularly players in the Nigerian livestock industry, the opportunity to showcase our businesses to the global community with a view to attracting investors and also highlighting modern and global best practices in the livestock management for maximum returns. The summit, which aims at enlightening stakeholders, investors, and the general public on the inherent investment opportunities in the livestock subsector, and to correct the misconceptions on government's intention in initiating the National Livestock Transformation Plan, drew stakeholders from the different states across the nation, from Borno, Benue, Niger, amongst others. Annie T. Patrick, Core TV News, Abuja.